Հավանաշրջանի <gülüyor> 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 Yeah, as he said, it's uh, for me as the head coach, is the first game uh, to have such a prestige team. Uh, but uh, as always, uh, my expectations are the same, that my team tomorrow steps in the pitch to give its best, to play our game, to keep to our game plan and uh, to, to enjoy. That's, uh, that's every match that we do, um, this is what we look for and tomorrow it will not be different. We are very happy, of course, to play such a prestige club uh, in a, such a nice um, stadium. But when the whistle starts tomorrow, everything will just go normally. Yeah, I think the motivation for our club is the shirt that we wear, is Noah. I think that could not be a bigger motivation than this. Uh, to go into to the field and to be in such a, a good competition as is Conference League, making history that we already have done. So yeah, uh, you are right. It's not it's not difficult to give the motivation, but that's uh, every day. You know, our boys have been since the first uh, the first day of the, that we started this season. Their motivation every time for the trainings, for the games are up. So I hope that tomorrow uh, I don't have to give them too much. Too much play we know that we are playing a fantastic team as Chelsea. We know that they are the favourites. They are they, they they have the whole whole responsibility. We know this. We accept this. We we are very humble to to understand this. But to park the bus, not with me. Ten years ago, there weren't really any um, Western European players or, or managers that moved to Armenia. What, what persuaded you to to make what seems like? So it's quite an unusual move. Yeah, you're right. Uh, it was very easy. I fell in love with the project. I fell in love with our present uh, vision for the club because he wants to put the name of uh, Noah in the European football uh, talk. So this is something that moved me. Also, what he wants to do in the, inside the, the, national, the National League, the way he wants to help to develop also Armenian football, you know, I'm, I'm a person that feels uh, good with these kinds of projects because uh, from all the experience that I gather, I think I have to give something back also to football. So it was very easy for me to take uh, the decision uh, to come to this, uh, to this club and be a part of, of its growing, growing up. 
understand there were some protests during the last round of league matches where supporters interrupted games to protest the running of the, the way politically Armenian football is run. How was your experience as it been as, as an outsider? I, I just arrived here to, to the Armenian football, as you know. Uh, my focus is completely only on the club. We, of course, we work with the, with the federation to try also to give our ideas to, to improve what needs to be improved. And I think the people speak for themselves. I cannot speak for them. And the role that we do as a club is to be helpful to the, to the federation, to the Armenian federation, to help them in any way that we think it's, it's a, the, that we can promote and move Armenian football up, up the level. So this is what we are looking for and this is what we do. The rest is political, we don't get to you. Aaron Motak, Kadrain, Arceli Shurch, Videnk, Vorkhara, Gbaz, Ktovni, Toronin, Sona, 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 Vorkhara, Gbaz, Ktovni, Toronin, Sona,